Established in 1961 as one of the 17 pioneering RECs, this institute was the first to introduce a CSE in BTEC in 1976. In 2002, this institution transformed into an NIT and a deemed university fully funded by the Government of India. Motilal Nehru National Institute of Technology, Allahabad stands tall with an overall score of 4.1 out of 5 on Shiksha.com. It has also received 4 stars for its BTEC. How are the engineering courses offered here? Find out in this review video, starting with the placements rated 4.5 stars. As the 2023-24 placement season progresses at MNNIIT, 420 plus recruiters have already made 1,170 offers. The highest packet so far has already touched 63.78 lakh per annum. But will it touch last year's 135 lakh per annum mark is yet to be seen. The average salary packages at MNNIIT have risen by 50% in the last three years, starting at 13.55 lakh per annum in 2021 and 20.34 lakh per annum in 2023. This compares very favourably when compared with similarly ranked NIT Jalandhar. Students get placed with top companies such as Google, Accenture, Microsoft, IBM, Goldman Sachs, Wipro, Dell, Atlassian, Adobe, and Texas Instruments. Top roles offered include Software Development Engineer, Web Development, Data Analyst, Product Manager, and Consultant. While students can pursue internships starting with their third year, these opportunities are limited. Approximately 60 companies visit the campus specifically for internships, yet only 30 to 40% of students are able to secure these. Starting with four specializations in BTEC in 1976-77, with CSC being the pioneering branch, today MNIT has a bigger academic wingspan, offering as many as nine BTEC specializations. MNIT demands a 75% score in 10 plus 2 and successes in JEE main. The cutoff trend suggests that compared to 2022, closing ranks for civil, electrical, ECE, biotechnology, and chemical branches have tightened, tightened. while those for CSE, mechanical, production, and industrial engineering have eased out. A comparison with similarly ranked NIT Jalandhar indicates MNIT being the hot favorite by a long distance for the same BTEC branches. With a BTEC cost of around 7.88 lakhs and an average salary expectation soaring 20.34 lakhs, MNIT has earned a stellar 4.3 star rating for value for money. Coming to the 3.5 star rated infrastructure segment now. Established in 1961, MNIT's 222 acre campus carries a rich history. However, students report several challenges outdated classrooms and labs, malfunctioning ACs, only two water coolers for 700 students, and frequent power cuts. These issues underscore the urgent need for infrastructure improvements. MNIT accommodates students with seven boys' hostels and two girls' hostels. While first-year students enjoy spacious rooms, they are shared by three students. In contrast, second, third and fourth-year students find themselves in notably smaller rooms. The food quality here strikes a middle ground being neither exceptional nor terrible. Students criticize the mess food for its lack of flavor. Additionally, the absence of non-veg options means those craving such meals have to seek them outside the campus. The college offers a wide array of sports activities such as squash, athletics, cricket, badminton, football, basketball, tennis, and cocoa. MNIT has received a 3.8 star rating in faculty and course curriculum. While not exceptional, the teaching quality is decent and contributes positively to students' academic growth. Most of the teachers are supportive. They possess extensive expertise and deliver lectures in both Hindi and English. There are two exams per semester. The difficulty level is above average, but attentive students can achieve a 7 plus CGPA. However, professors are known for their strict grading, making it essential to stay diligent throughout. Shifting gears to the 4.1 star rated campus life. MNIT's Dynamic Student Activity Centre is the heart of campus life, orchestrating a variety of cultural, technical and managerial events. Home to around 19 diverse clubs, the SAC offers students a vibrant platform to engage, explore and shine in their passions. The college also hosts a cultural as well as a techno-management fest. The institute currently stands at 49th spot in NIRF, enduring a loss of a couple of spots within one year. For more details on MNNIIT Alabad and to check out thousands of course and college reviews, visit shiksha.com. We'd like to hear from you, so do drop in a comment below and do not forget to like and share this video.